All right, so I don't normally do toy hunts and stuff like that, but we're gonna go into this Target right here and just see what's going on. I know it's the uh, retro indie wave today, so let's go check it out. Okay, we're over in the legend section. And of course, everything went on clearance. So they got nothing here for that. I do have these, these kind of look cool, but I can't believe that is $18.89. That does not make any sense. Um, you got these um, Super 7s, look pretty cool. Rakondos here. Got those D&D &D figures, got some of these D&Ds. Those are pretty cool. So exciting. And Power Rangers. I don't know. That's in the wrong place, I'm guessing, right? There's some uh, Jurassic Park. Of course, this is supposed to be the launch day for those uh, indie retros. Nothing. I've not seen them at all. Look at that. What kind of a cell is that? Spider-Man card. You want me to put it down right here? Look at that. It's spidey. That makes it Here's the big holothon. Finally put up an end cap, but it's in the back. Oh, that's interesting. Check this guy out. Almost tempted. All right, so those Marvel Legends got moved way over here. Look, that guy's 12 bucks. Kenobi's uh, 15. Look at that guy. Ned's 15. I wonder if they're 15. This guy's supposedly 12, but I wonder if they're actually cheaper. I may check them out. That Kenobi's crazy. And they got them over on the regular shelf too. We're gonna walk over there in a minute. And that's kind of cool too. Well, look at that, sixteen ninety nine. So I did go and scan these, and that is fifteen bucks. And this one uh, right here, twelve forty nine. So these are on clearance for sure. Look at the little motorcycle back here for sixteen ninety nine. That's the one that uh, kind of reminds me of that um, Galactica nineteen eighty. Okay, I see everybody else walking over into their little NECA section. And uh, there's like a plethora of stuff. You can see this is pretty minimalistic. There's not much here. Um, there might be something somebody wants, but nothing that I'm looking for. I'm looking for that two pack, the um, Last of Us one. I've never, ever seen it in store. Uh, sorry for the voiceover, but there was like some really loud music playing in the store. This Target has like the little mini Disney store, so I just walked over to check out to see if they would have had the indie retros or display in here, but of course they didn't. It was mostly like uh, littler kids stuff um, and the, the princess dolls. You did have the Buzz Lightyear section here, and they do have a Star Wars section where they are showing the Kenobi as 2204, but we know in the store it's on clearance. So it's kind of interesting that they didn't change the shelf tag on that. General Lando is still full price, but Kenobi is on sale. Okay, here we go. Target number two. Let's go check it out. Okay, Bandai here. Not as messed up as the other store. Look at those shoes for those Tech Techs. That's pretty cool. So we got all our wrestling. Look at that, one dude, one lone dude. Oh no, I'm sorry, there's more up there. I don't think these are on clearance in here, but like, can you imagine $31? How is that possible? You got an Ahsoka here. Avatar, I won't be getting any of those. Jurassic, these stores are really set up differently. It's an interesting thing. Okay. Got a lot of condos, man. That. Oh, look at that. Python Patrol. Got a couple of them right in there. Another condo. We're here. Oh, look at that. Whole bunch of Python Patrols. Oh, 
Those guys are not on clearance at this store. Dungeons and Dragons, Power Rangers up there. Look at the price differences. Uh, I don't know. And these guys don't appear to be on clearance here, but um, they might be. Why don't we uh, take one and scan it? Yep, just not tagged. And of course this Target has a much cleaner NECA section than the other one, but still nothing really new um, here that I haven't seen anywhere else and still no Last of Us figures, unfortunately, but check that out. There's a Cobra guy over here too. So anyways, but thought that was pretty interesting. I had to ask, this guy was in the back. So yep, on release day, at least I got a Indiana Jones. So that's pretty cool. Okay, let's go home.